But we did make a decision on a place. Oh, in here? Maybe, maybe we'll be neighbors, maybe we won't. Yesterday's vlog, we were talking about efficiency, right? Tools to make it easier, especially with these dogs. Here is a, like a mini husky, basically, and she sheds. If I go like this, air just right there, boom, and it sprinkles all over the floor. So this brush, it not only rips the hair out, but you push it, it'll push all the hair off, and at the same time, it's got a desensitizing thing that shoots um, this mister, so it makes it nice and easy to get Kira's hair off. Softens her hair, she likes it, she has a good time. No homo guys, but I had to take my shirt off because her hair just flies everywhere. Her summer coat is coming in and all her winter fur is falling off. This house just turns into a giant Kira bed full of her fur. I mean, look at that, that's a couple swipes in. That's pretty bad. That's just a couple little swipes. I used to have three Huskies, and holy, one swipe of this, there would have been hair flying all over the place. But that's how the morning started. Hope you guys are having an amazing day. Hope you guys have been enjoying the vlogs. I'm gonna finish up here, and we're gonna get the day started, huh? <laughs> You're doing so good. This is all. Kira. That's just a couple swipes. I mean, it's everywhere. Look, if I, the broom, shed monsters. The beauty of owning dogs, man. Unless they're hypoallergenic. Are any of you guys allergic to dogs? I haven't met somebody personally that's like, I can't be around dogs, I start sneezing and stuff. Cats, I've heard. The cool news is we actually had a person come by the house earlier this morning to come, you know, do the inspection and make sure the house is clean. They just told us that we gotta clean the carpets and you guys can see right behind that TV, there's like holes and stuff when they, whoever the first guy is that like tried to mount this TV, completely messed up and put it way in the corner where the TV couldn't swivel. So that was a terrible idea. Man, this is gonna be a pain. Pain move, bro. Look at this. This massive thing is hanging off. I can pull it forward. It's hanging on just by these four screws. That's kind of scary. Oh, man. Ugh. This thing always sketches me out because... <laughs> what if this bitch falls? This thing is so heavy. You would think it's like pretty light because it's all thin and stuff, but... That boy is heavy. Least favorite thing I'm looking forward to moving when we move. <laughs> don't want to touch that. I don't want to move that. Just leave it where it's at. <laughs> this look exactly Are you looking like at the two bedroom? Yeah. This is the same. This is the exact same one. No, oh, we live but the layout's the same. Yeah. This is, this is nice. Yeah. I like yeah. that. I like the I like medium countertop. So what we're doing right now is we're actually looking at places in our complex. This is a two bedroom with a loft. Hold on, let me come up there. Huh? Let's go, let's see if it has the uh, secret room. 44? Oh, it doesn't have a secret room. It's got a, uh, here, go inside. So it's good. Yeah, it's best. I'm just kidding. What are you <laughs> What is that for? Like, what are you putting here? Storage. I shall disappear. When you close this, you're gonna close this, and I'm gonna be gone. You have the same exact part that you had. Where did he right. go? So it's actually an elevator. You go in there and you, huh? yeah, you close it and you, you appear at the bottom. Look, close it. See? I told you. Yeah, I told you. Right. I told you. So let me show you. 
<laughs> this is where you pop up at. This is pretty cool. I actually really like this. Uh, it's like a teleporter from Call of Duty. Yeah. They got a tube there when that looked just like this, but I was like a zombie. Halloween. It looked just like this. It wasn't bad. So once you, once you get off the elevator, you appear. This is your room, what? About like right here. There, there you go. You put your bed right there. No, this go. is where you appear once you get off the elevator. Oh yeah, when you go down the elevator, you, you'll pop up right here. But this could also be your bed. No. <laughs> Just kidding. <laughs> I think at the... This is cool. Nice closet space. There's even more... Ooh. Sorry. You, what are you... <laughs> There's more closet space right here. There's a cool. I'm assuming this would be your bedroom, right? My game will, my game will be up there. Jeez, relax. If we get this one, I can probably. I like go this. Home. I like the fact that it's got a countertop. If we get this one, I can probably go hunt Pokemon. Yes, it is. Oh, you'd be right here with us. You can go walk, rock around, and go get some Pokemon. Why do they have that all the way up there? Yeah, I get to walk around. Oh, yeah. Just makes it look more open. I could do it's it. ambiance. 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 Oh, yeah. This I'll is kind of weird, honey. I want to get this right Why do they have this? What? It's probably because it was clean. It's dirty as hell. <laughs> uh, the walking closet? Ooh. That's nice. It's, I wonder if this is an elevator, too. It is. Watch. What? what are you guys doing in the, how did you get into the, how did you go from the closet to the oh, bathroom? I think it teleports him right here. That's crazy, man. This this is a weird house. We should not be in here. I think it's haunted. Yeah, this is weird. Come on, man. Let's get out of here. Oh, oh wait, I wonder, I wonder if it works for me. It does. Watch. I'm going to throw you in here. Okay. And in the closet. See? What is that creepy? <laughs> Don't do that. <laughs> no, watch, we're gonna make him pop up back over here. Watch. You see? So what's wrong with this guy? Get out of here, man. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I just seen that they finally revealed Halo's face. I know, I saw it. Thank God. <laughs> I don't have to edit anymore. Oh. All right, dude. That's all all right, right, dude. Boom! Just kidding. Oh, we didn't even check out the, the they got a secret storage out here. They got another teleporter. Where does this one go? We'll see. All right, we'll see you in a second. Okay. Pretty sick. I don't know where that one leads to. Like. What? I have to what? Like, like you. Like, you cannot put the mouth on This place is weird, I'm telling you. It seems like it's making him go crazy. Get out of here, man. This is just like your old place. Yeah, it's literally just like when it's we're. Weirder. Huh? It's weirder. Weirder? It is weirder. Like, you're going from one place to another. I don't know. I I go in the fridge. No, no, no. <laughs> <laughs> but um, so we're looking at uh, apartments in our complex. That'd be sick if you guys moved back over here. We're well, debating whether we're gonna stay. Huh? Yeah. We made a decision already. Um, I'll let Val announce it, but we did make a decision on a place, and uh, you'll find out later in the video. Maybe, maybe we'll be neighbors. Maybe we won't. <laughs> only in the top floor. Yeah, I only want to live in the top floor. That's it. I'm gonna show you this since your mom wants to see two bedrooms. I'm gonna show you this other one that we looked at. I just call it Ding Dong Ditch. Is that okay? No, you better not. Well, I like uh, um, at like 3 a.m. just run out the door, come and Ding Dong Ditch. Yeah, right. That's why we're not gonna move here. <laughs> we're not staying here. I think I was over here. I wasn't over here like I didn't sign up. No. Literally, her old place. That's crazy. <laughs> it is available. This is her old spot. Of course, it is available. Yeah, that's crazy. This is the one I got. Wow, that's nice. I know, but 
Uh, looking at an apartment. So we're checking out our complex first. Um, we obviously have. Me and Val did a lot of debating yesterday, so regardless of our decision, our decision has already been made. Huh? Let's see if this one is weird. Don't be scared. It should be. This one's got like a hallway. What are you doing up here? I came out of this. Huh? I came out of this. Oh, this I got a secret room. That is a secret room. They always have these secret rooms. I love these secret rooms. Go in. No. I'll go in. Here, I'll go in. There should be a switch in here. Go in. I'll go in. Wait, hold on. There's a light. Flashlight over there. That's a tiny secret room. This isn't tiny. Yeah, it is. You can walk on. Brittany's touring. <laughs> Which is, so, are you guys going to come back? Hell no. I'm just going to I'm going to fly for it. All right. One, so, two. Let's take her to our car because she's going down. Oh, two. Come what? on. Two? No, P1. Someone press it to go down. Oh, we're going to be one. Damn. Shame on them. Hey. But, um, we gotta go a ghost? Up. A ghost hit it. Nice. You can come in, bro. Just kidding. What if we saw but, an extra uh, reflection right here? In the <laughs> so, so they're touring. We already actually made our decision whether we're staying or going, but we'll let you know a little bit later. What is that? Um, if she doesn't get approved, I'll be on the streets. See <laughs> it! <laughs> By the time you guys are watching this, it's already 4th of July. Um, we're gonna go here. And uh, you guys are probably out enjoying so i hope you guys are safe hope you guys are enjoying this vlog remember when we lived at the old house we bought a bunch of firewood and lit them off in the street we thought our neighborhood was full of karens and they were going to be like on our ass but they were like cool with it they all came out and enjoyed the they all came too. outside and just like Psh. our neighbors were really cool too shout out to our old neighbors yeah. uh i don't know do we go to arizona <laughs> what are we gonna do i'm down to go to arizona i miss your family I mean, we're leaving tonight. Yeah, we have to leave today. Today, yes. Today, yes, tonight. today. I don't know. We'll see. Right now, we're gonna go over to the mall, get some food. I actually took pictures of my entire Nintendo Switch setup. I haven't been using the Switch. It's an OLED Switch. I make the joke about GameStop all the time, how they don't give you the full amount that you initially pay for, which is funny because I spent, just on this OLED switch alone was 300. Not including, what, $60 each game, 50, $60 each game. Then I got a pro controller. So I'm gonna bring, I'm not gonna bring my switch with me just cause I'm, I don't know if I'm really gonna sell it. But I wanna see how much they would actually give me for all this stuff. We also gotta eat. It's already five o'clock in the afternoon. Our day is, is just toasted, dude. I actually found the time to sit down and cook some food recently. Um, if you guys have been keeping up with me on Snapchat, but just running and gunning, man. We, it's hard to find just a second to cook as much as I'd like to. It's not that we don't have groceries now, because we do, but it's time. I almost hit that lady. I almost hit this car. I almost got five stars. <laughs> yeah. So we're just gonna make a quick run of the mall. I'm gonna go test my theory at GameStop and see. I would say I've spent on that Switch alone, we should be at like $700 worth of Nintendo Switch stuff. 
Let's see what we get for it. This should be interesting. <laughs> $11.20. So with the pro membership, 13. 13 or 14, probably okay. 13. Uh, Super Smash? Super Smash Bros. Ultimate? Yeah. yeah. Super Smash Cash, it'll be $16.10. With your pro membership, this is 18. 18. Uh, two more. Mario Kart. The 8 the Deluxe? Uh, Mario Kart Deluxe, yeah. Cash would be twenty one dollars, so with your pro twenty three, maybe twenty three, twenty four. Okay. Uh, and Pokemon Violet's the last one. Fourteen cash, so maybe sixteen. 16 with your pro. 16-ish, okay. OLED was like 105, 120 after the pro membership. And then, uh, do you guys take the pro controllers? The Mario, I mean the, uh, the yeah, that I black say, one. Yeah, I want to say yes. yes yeah? Yes. Much as that traded for if, I mean, it's literally brand, brand new, so. That I don't know because I have to test it. You know, it's only the, the price. That one I, I can't get. Not even a rough estimate. Let's see if I can. Uh, Pro controller. Just the basic one, right? Yeah, yeah that, literally that black one. It says if it's a Switch Pro controller and it's just the basic one, mm -hmm. fourteen dollars cash. How much are they new? They're like sixty bucks or something. Sixty. All right, brother. I appreciate it. I'm gonna. Uh, I'm, I'm gonna. That. No, it's all good. I'm gonna. I'm gonna, help you a little. I'm gonna add it all up and debate if it's worth it. If, if so, I'll come back in. Understood. I appreciate happy it. Day. Happy Fourth. Fourth. Yeah, happy Fourth of July. So I'm gonna go get some food. We're gonna add this up. <laughs> nowhere. Those numbers. Nowhere near what I paid for it. That's. That's GameStop. That's a part of business. They gotta make, they gotta buy it for the low. Cause you're trying to dump it immediately, right? They're gonna buy it for the low and they're probably gonna resell it for double the amount that they gave it to me. That's why if you're gonna buy anything, just make sure it's worth your money. Cause basically taking a 70, 75% loss just to enjoy it for a couple hours, or a couple months. <laughs> Am I gonna sell it? Probably not. I just thought it'd be interesting to see what GameStop would offer. So they offered on the OLED switch, they offered 105 without the pro membership. So with the pro membership, probably like a buck twenty. And I paid three hundred for it. Ouch. <laughs> Sick man. Look at this. Look at this. Oh look at the Ferrari. We should build something like that. Damn, this is How's it going? Legos have gotten so crazy throughout the years, man. The Back to the Future Lego set. How sick. For $200. My oily, my Switch won't even sell for them. <laughs> this is our Harry Potter Lego set. Uh, yeah, we have our Harry Potter section over in the middle of this wall here. Oh. And we've got a lot of sets right now, actually. The what? Oh, uh, we have a lot of them right now, actually. Oh, oh, damn. Uh, everything from here on over to this column. That is a lot of, oh, man. Yeah, there's a lot of options. Uh, and I believe, let's see. And I believe we also have Diagon Alley, another really big set like that one, over in stock with our 18 plus system right there. Okay. Uh, but for the most part, everything's over this way. Okay, okay. thank you. Uh, yeah, thank have fun looking around. And. 469, the entire Hogwarts castle. This is crazy, bro. That's pretty, that's pretty weird. Look at it, it looks like this. It's actually bigger than this. Diagon Alley. Another 400. Look at that guy, dude. Giant monster castle. I don't even know where that's from. You really don't know where that's from? No. Where's it from? Wow. Where's it from? Lord of the Rings? I don't watch Lord of the Rings. That's from Lord of the Rings? Yes. I'm not, a, I'm not a Lord of the Rings fan, man. I'm a Hogwarts, I'm a uh, 
uh, Harry Potter fans. I'll take Star Wars, Harry Potter over Lord of the Rings. Bro, I tried watching Lord of the Rings. I damn near died, bro. I fell asleep in that bitch. I watch uh, Game of Thrones. I'm a big Game of Thrones fan, bro. I watched the whole thing. Although the ending was poop. Poop poo meat. That's the difference between kids and adults. Kids can go crazy and yell and act a fool. If an adult did that, I'm like, what the hell is wrong with you? Let me know in the comments. Should we spend, should we drop, did you do it? Did you do it? We're playing. I got man. it. You got it? Let me know in the comments. It's like $500 for freaking Lego set now. When did that happen? When I was a kid, Legos were free. <laughs> I don't know how much Legos cost. I just know that my dad would buy them and I'd play with them. I, don't, I never knew a Lego set could be as much as $500. Anyways, um, let me know in the comments, should we buy a Lego set and then every day just give you an update on the progress of where we're at? I've always thought that'd be a cool idea, but if so, what Lego set should we get? You wanna build a Harry Potter Lego set with me? Yeah. Let me move. Awesome. <laughs> Let's go eat. Do you know how much they offer me on the Nintendo Switch? Guess how much they offer me on the Switch. Just guess. 150. Close. 120. Damn. That's crazy. Yeah. Imagine just getting a freaking Switch, a whole system for 120 bucks. We paid 300 something for it. Right. Finesse. That's what GameStop should be called. Finesse. Your so, choice today was Chipotle. You can get it literally a I ended up going with brown rice. Someone had mentioned to me, I posted a tweet saying what's better, brown or white rice? Some of y'all said brown rice is better? I don't know if I really like the taste of it. I'm kind of regretting it. I like my white rice, bro, my jasmine. But they said that white rice has a lot of um, sugar or something, I don't know. Brown rice don't taste the best though, I'm not gonna lie. It's all right. That was good. I'm good. Chipotle, three out of five. Not the biggest fan, but better than eating. God damn. It's better than eating um, hot dog on a stick, boy. I know you're editing and all this stuff. Val just did a uh, anime try on haul. It looked pretty good. You guys can go see it over on her channel. <laughs> it's 3.27 in the morning. No joke. I literally almost ended off this vlog without saying what we're doing. <laughs> I totally blanked that. I'm like, oh yeah, that's the point. We made the decision that we are staying. Want to tell them why? Because the security here is the best. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And the amenities. I, I like everything. All you together. like the gym. Yep. Um, the price. Well, the price that we pay for for this spot. I'm. It's. I'm not gonna lie. I'm not a fan. I'm not a fan. Um, I mean, the price we're still gonna pay is still like. Yeah, but so we decided we're gonna stay but we're getting a bigger spot. So, um, and it makes it easy for us to just, without doing more deposits or uh, all these background checks, there's a lot that goes into it when you, have, when you apply for an apartment. You have to do an application, you have to um, do a security deposit to hold the, the spot, the, the unit that you want, then you give them either bank statements or checks. They run the background check on all of that. Um, Social Security, you get a hit on your credit. And then um, it's just the whole process, guys, to be honest. And so we did do one house. I'm not going to lie. We did look at one house. Mm -hmm. And what was the problem with that house? I don't remember. It was, there was no gate. Oh, right. There was no gate. <laughs> no gate. It was uh, literally worse security than before. 
And for us, that's probably a it's a really big priority now these days. Just because, bro, when we lived at the old house, porch pirates up the ass. People literally just pull up to the crib, steal all your Amazon packages, unless you got like a, a lockbox that you give to Amazon. I don't know, bro. I'm just not dealing with all that. So um, you guys also said, why don't you just move to Arizona already and get the house? The, the long story short is we already have a house in Arizona. <laughs> We're good. Um, invest in land. We've already invested in land. I literally, like, <laughs> you have like a whole like cabin in a forest too in Arizona. We're set up in AZ. Um, yeah, for it's like basically we're working to set up our retirement plan. <laughs> when we're, whenever we're ready to like just settle down, maybe have a kid, and just not deal with the madness of L what is LA um we're pretty set up for Arizona life I'll just give them a little sneak peek like just I think I'm gonna make this part of this on my thumbnail she, she dressed as a uh, street fight that was a street fighter character mm -hmm. now the scary thing which we're a little concerned about <laughs> is we picked an apartment here which said more square footage but we have zero clue of what it looks like. They didn't have a unit to show. All of them are occupied, but because it's available to market and the person's 100% moving out, so we can move in. Uh, and it's the biggest version of that layout. And it's the nicest one. So the only issue is we just don't, we haven't, we can't tour it. We can't, literally cannot go inside. Somebody's living in there right now. So <laughs> until, this month ends, we have zero clue what we even picked. <laughs> we just said, price looks good. The Space square looks square footage looks amazing. It is over a thousand square feet, thank Jesus. But we just have zero clue to what it looks like. So, yeah. That's the only thing we're nervous about. <laughs> but yeah, so we're pretty set up. Um, in terms of like the future. That's something that me and Val always talk about is the future. What are we gonna do? down the road um so you know especially like when when this one starts growing when things get crazy but it is very 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 late right now it's 3 31 i am tired i hope you guys are having an amazing fourth of july i love you guys thank you so much for tuning into the videos i will see you in the next one and remember if you woke up today you already Got the double U. Wolf Kang.